acceptable unto you, our God, our rock, and our redeemer. Yet there was a special position. Never yet was so for me ever so I eat your hand. There's one song as a young man. Some of you soon as I mean, yet I see. Yet for our bra in share was in Conconium, yam. Wowed about Jesus Christ in the Amen. Mr. Wama Yansinasi. Presiding Bishop, sir, I am most grateful for asking me to say a few words at this inauguration and induction of the Kwabenya circuit and the first superintendent minister. Okay. Um, as a teacher, a few words uh, are relative. Relative. Uh, so we'll, we'll try and do a few words. But very, very relative. He himself is also a teacher, you see, so a uh, few words, very relative. Congratulations, Kwabenya Circuit. Oye hini nyije, de dem abri abum, na oye dem abri so. Se e sha boko samina, na abri a washa si de warika, in chima owe de oba akra diocese, ye chime bien. A family your northern Accra houses, a family your Accra houses. The man building there, no carbon circuit is washed as a work and was some. It's way in some here now. Check, the umbrellas, no wa we here. Yet the name Asi, wo i ni na o. I have chosen a theme: love, the source of church growth. There's a sonu botum puna, a sonu beina. Did a yachre a do when yami ne jumahu and the text is first Peter chapter two and verse five. First Peter two and verse five. And Vanson Ossi Homoso what's the day in you can go a watu home soon soon with them. As of Uku Konkrawa, Wobo Wobo Sun Sun, Wobo Sun Sun, my for a on them Jesus Christ do so, on them Jesus Christ do so, Nyami, any. You too are living stones built as an edifice of the Spirit into a holy priesthood offering. Spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God through Jesus Christ. The gospel story, which was read from Matthew 16, 13 through 19, is a story set within Peter's confession at Caesarea Philippi, a town known for its gods and uh, formerly a center of worship of the god called Baal. We know that Philip the Tetrarch had put on its hillside a temple of white marble to the godhead of the Roman Emperor Caesar. And it was said that this place was the place of birth of um, the god Pan, who is a Greek god of nature. Now, Jesus engages his disciples in a conversation around this place and asks them the question, who do people say that I am? Now, the focus of the question is not about an identity crisis on Jesus' part. It is on the state of the faith of the apostles. What is your faith? Already in Mark's gospel, different interest groups, demons or demoniacs, evil spirits, Jewish authorities, have given their own opinions who Jesus Christ was. The apostles' initial answer 
about who this man was or is reflected the confused state of the people some say you are that others say you are that others say you are that and then jesus put the question right to them about you who do you say that i am jesus was right because the disciples having been with him for the past three years were qualified for a degree a bth degree or a master's degree they were qualified and so jesus wanted their personal view personal view the faith that we have and especially as methodists requires us to have a personal encounter with this jesus christ not that they say they say not that according to this according to that but having said all that according to me this is what i say if this circuit will grow and we pray that it does if your work as the first superintendent minister of the circuit will see the light of day which we are praying fervently for it demands you my brother it demands you the circuit to have a personal relationship with god who do people say that i am so who are you so the same question which borders on selfhood the same question which borders on identity about what makes us tick as Methodists and as Christians is our question for Kwabinya is our question for the superintendent who do people say that you are who do people say that you are Kwabinya circuit who do people say that you are or sofu or when you wanna circuit or when you wanna every juma nepe de easy or when you wanna superintendent every juma na epe de isi and our answer is you two are living stones built as an edifice of spirit not as an edifice of uh, uh, human being or carnal whatever but a spirit not only that into a holy priesthood not only that offering spiritual sacrifices acceptable to god through jesus christ acceptable to god not through the gods of caesarea philippi but through jesus christ once we are able to understand it this way that anyansu yeye abutana nyame watu nyande yeye eden sunsun yeye adasufu yeye asofuku na yezi hanu hu aba for yeza manyame na no som ye nam jesus christ yeye de mejuma na ono no manyan sekiti waste mu so who are you writing to the church of his day the first pope used imagery that can be applied equally to the church today he says you two are living stones built as an edifice of spirit into a holy priesthood offering spiritual sacrifices acceptable to god through christ peter's words reflect the words of the book of exodus centuries earlier you shall be to me a kingdom of priests a holy nation exodus 19 and verse 6. here we find who we are what we are all about what our mission is and what we ought to be a royal priesthood a holy nation a redeemed people a blessed community this is what we are called to be upon entry into covenant relationship with the lord in peter's letter read today we learned that one cannot participate in spreading the faith or in any other spiritual activity without first 
growing in personal holiness. As of when the um, induction was going on, we said that Osofo's authority lies in holiness. Holiness. So unless we grow in personal holiness, yere pirude yebe ye konkron wo soma ye somna za ye ye nyina oyekwa oyekwa and that can only happen when we let jesus become the foundation stone of our lives a stone that will be rejected by others because it's nonsense to be to other people but for us and to us who have believed in him we know how precious that stone is and that's a stone that we must emulate the characteristics of a stone that we we must emulate and so if kwabenya circuit if you as a superintendent will work so well improve the circuit and all that it behoves us to strive at personal holiness aya method is easy minyim minyim de nyim john wesley nin sama okaka pi nyim nyin Often, conquering your own in your we must try, strive, strive. There, your circuit, I hear Bob Mosin day, your bear conquering, Mister, now you can, Mama, I sorry, baby, I'm a fucking thing, baby, I'm a fun to suffer, be a rat now, cream. That shall not tempt any or suffer, shall not tempt. And uh, we also believe that even when that temptation comes, we can say that when Christ in the vessel, we smile at the storm. Smile at the storm. It's a two-way traffic. As living stones in the church, we become by Christ's power and love members of the chosen race, sharing a royal priesthood. In church, you grow up one day. You bet us there. Say, yeah, yeah, lay. And now, yeah, yeah, I suffer. Yeah, yeah, I suffer. Cool. What me and us there? Yeah, yeah, I suffer. Cool. And can now change him now. Yeah, can we? Now, one casa. What ya doing there? One fine hand, one fancy chant. Now you're so much. In some way, I suffer. Yeah, yeah, I suffer. Also, there's a distinction. The distinction is that you are the lay, and we are the clergy. The distinction is that because of what you wanted us to do, we have been specially trained to be effective and for pastoral ministry. And therefore, you may be a year yen lay fun to me yet. Untu me yet. Say go to my ya, did the upaha, did the ayang say as na kare woman yen me you so on by your sofu. Into our sofu juman. Oh, we there. We join him. Yeah, yeah, you man. Now you tell us they're late in Greek laws. Oh, yeah, the people of God. But when we say the people of God, there are two types of people in the church: the lay and the clergy. That is why in our system, in our system, we are not called priests. We are called reverend ministers revered ministers the ministers who serve the other ministers and this is a priesthood that we are we are we are talking about that all of us are priests and yet there's a distinction and that is why each and every one of us i'll say that later that each and every one of us must be in his or her lane the more the this calling in Christianity is an inner conviction that the cold is subjectively aware of and responds wholeheartedly. And so like the Israelites of old, we become a holy nation by our being set apart through baptism. So wow, but we soon could see now Jesus the Jesus Christ the Wokrana Waji and Kwan Wei Razi Nebibiara Za No no was we sin chen I your conkron Amma Erazi. So all true Christians are therefore chosen 
chosen generation. We all make up one family. Ya ye a sort and species of people distinct from the common world. We have been separated. Like Israelites, Awofi, Egypt, Warabas Nako, Canaan. Na Odu baby, Egyptians and Wataho, Ebazna Yunguni, Yunguni, Yankupon, or the Munukum, Kasi, Abba, or my Egypt, if you want to mina, one being Israel. Na Abra Woko, Red Sea, Numusu, Odu baby, Yankupon, or Mount Sun. And therefore, as Christians, we appreciate that anytime God sets us apart, He sets us apart from the world and He sets us apart unto Himself. And so, despite our um, our national, racial, and social background diverse, we are still united in Christ. We are made up of a holy nation under one head, agreeing in the same manner and customs, governed by the same laws, consecrated and devoted to God, renewed and sanctified by the Holy Spirit. We become God's people. And so all true servants of Christ are a royal priesthood. Let's appreciate that. But But a superintendent. They are royal in their relation to God and their relation to Christ. In their power with God and over themselves and all their spiritual enemies. They are a royal priest who separated from sin and sinners and consecrated to God, offering to God spiritual services and uh, oblations, sacrifices to God through Christ. That is why Saddamon then as a circuit and as the first superintendent and as all other superintendents will come to do, this puts you in a good position to do a well thought out evangelistic programs to consolidate the gains so far made and build on it as we respond especially to what conference is asking us to do 10% growth of our membership we must not be complacent we must not be satisfied with our current numbers no as you bring in new members disciple making should be not should not be lost on you and this calls for all leaders calls for all class leaders lay preachers evangelists etc etc to come on board all under your leadership as superintendent there is therefore the need for effective lay leadership training in the circuit. Effective lay leadership training. So that the lay will understand what work they are supposed to do. And how together with the clergy we form a team to do God's work in the circuit. In the Sosofo Fre, the circuit team, Woman Yambra, Nayan Chetre. I'm a year two Juma conference or I'm a hand there. Yen ya or ha ye bumuda ye bumanche inumudu ye two years are back on yano members who the mafia and che ye two mina ya 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 na from Zinso in pen pee a sofa for meetings are yamba yamba. The society bishop said this diocese, Northern Accra diocese, is a model diocese. And as a model diocese, this is also a model circuit. Is that right? Uh -huh. And as a result of that, we pledge on behalf of all the members and the stewards and everybody that when you call a meeting, we will come. Is that not it? Uh -huh. if, if they don't come, 
God knows. God is a witness. So we got to equip the lay for ministry. The ministry of preaching, the ministry of teaching, the ministry of healing. These must be taught. These must be taught. You can heal it on yet them healing on Kovun Kofu, you know. Yeah, 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 sister, go to Papa Wee some years back. Now you crow a yinibi. Now you crow a yino. Ne a Judah. Ne a rabbin of Bumho would drink to the rubber by the master there. Moko ni Papene. In the I want to catch a sofa who yet there could sit and armband as in me. Nems eh. Now when then. Mamba does in view, you also saw a bay and chance a meeting and pier. Miss Abbas, no, okay, I'm in German capacity. Or so full cross. I wanna what to talk oil bin. Eh, one sorrow says, No, was all sorry. Or catch a good oh, we are a ban on cray. Or send their oil and enjoy their turn a hundred, new two fifty. That was serious. Or not to oil and a hundred, it is no two fifty. Instantly, you're a bon cray. This is not Methodist. This is not Methodist. Say what? Oh, you lump a yantan, yantan. This is not Methodist. Ne ya kumbiambia, ne wa yenza mo inda wa ye, ne yaze ba Methodist a sorry film on your Methodist. When you are teaching about healing, there there is a liturgy about that in the liturgy book. When you are teaching about preaching, when you are doing this about others, you got to be. The Methodist that you are. And as servants, we are honored to be God's peculiar people. We are the people of His acquisition. We are the people of His choice, care, and delight. That is why we need to seek unity among the people. The inauguration of the circuit, Kwabenya, and the induction of its superintendent, Mr. Presiding Bishop, gives us much joy for the growth and development we seek in this diocese. Something that any living organism must experience for recognition. We send us a Uba, Nessie, a Benny Nina, as no class as pity. As no class as pity, not that's right, and there, but in see. We must grow, we must develop. If there's stunted growth, there's problem. Nowhere in our church, nowhere in our diocese, northern Accra diocese, must we experience stunted growth, plateau. We must experience that. We must move on. And this man sitting here will, will push us to push you. To move. The diocese had made great progress over the past or the last few years with this diocese the last few months and we are united as a diocese. We are prompt with our responsibilities especially the payments of uh, our assets or our um, percentages and we are very prompt with that. We are very prompt with that. When they say we should take MDF, we do. And we do it well. This is the diocese. Which we jealously guard so that nothing will go amiss. That unity must be guarded if we want our diocese to continue growing with the same or even greater momentum. So it should not be said that head office is asking us to do this or the diocese is asking us to do this for Kwabenya Seki to say that we are not part of it. It shouldn't be heard. It shouldn't be heard. Kwabenya Seki has its part to play in this enterprise and that is what we got to do. SO Standing Order 604 1 to 9 I'm summarizing it. It says in the Methodist Church Ghana, the superintendent had and continues to play the role of overseer of the circuits. Although all superintendents are not members of the conference by right, 
they are agents who implement the decisions of the conference in the circuits. The superintendent protect the doctrines, preserve the doctrines, and give oversight to worship in the circuits. He, she, pastors, his or her fellow ministers, trains probationers and presides over all official meetings in the circuit. Relative to the above, the superintendent minister, by extension and implication, is the bishop of the circuit, an important administrator in the church. Such a role should not be lost on you. John Wesley, John, John, John Wesley will use superintendent instead of bishop. That is why in our church, Methodist Church, Ghana, superintendent is the highest you can attain. All others are cosmetics. All others are cosmetics. You see, so when you become a bishop, you become an administrative bishop, you become presiding bishop, when you finish your tenure, you don't come down, you just resume where you were previously as a superintendent. You haven't come down. We said go serve and then come and resume your position. That is all. And so the superintendent is the highest position in the Methodist Church Ghana. It's a wapim. Wapim. Any other that come. You see, that is why some time back the chairman became later general superintendent. It's as simple as that. Then the post now in here too much. Too much. And therefore, if you are a superintendent, see yourself as the boss of the uh, circuit working in tandem with your ministers. That is the superintendent. And such a role should not be lost on you. There we are. Consequently, the superintendent must be acknowledged or must be knowledgeable in matters spiritual. You must be knowledgeable in matters doctrinal. Must be knowledgeable in matters ecclesiastical. Bibiara offer so many years when you share when you must know. Bibiara offer a sum many years when you must know. Bibiara offer so many church when you must know. And this you must not compromise. You must not compromise. So sorry, Baba. No, Obaka Chow the E Y N D M A. We constitution of children. So on Thursday. If you are non can constitution, if you are non can Bible, um do will be a be drunk. Now children, eat them naughty, eat them naughty. As so for tea in church, I was a children on the phone. Three years in ministry in Trinity Theological Seminary. After that, two years or three years probation, six years. Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh bisa uh young spouses maybe so. Uh, yeah, yeah. Emi is a man who now when I want to hear computers is the one paddle. No one need BPRA. Computers, be someone. Was this the one paddle? What I wonder. Sunday, a German year, son. A summa year, son, or do all your method is a son. Do your method is son. Nancy, a sumbia waba, no coffee, be numbia water to watch out with him. Now, so be a was a saw, none, the baby away yet on your method is. Let Quabinia cease on some of those things. As you exercise such supervision as a pioneer superintendent, remember to be patient with those who serve with you as the key word for peace. Philippians 4 and verse 3. Patience refrains from rushing to avenge a wrong or insult. Yep, 
Tell patient, it's important. Be patient with things. Be patient with circumstances. Be patient with people. Be patient. Be patient. Also for fellas, don't let your induction as the first superintendent of the Kwabenya circuit be impactful. Teach the members in the circuit about scripture and about Methodism. Something that is especially apt for us as a church, especially as this year's theme enjoins us to intensify our teaching ministry towards disciple making. Let the circuit and your superintendents or superintendency be visible in the community. You reside in a community that offers great potential for evangelism and discipleship. You and the circuit are very close to the police station over here. Are very close to the police station. You are very close to the hospital over here. And you are within the atomic energy area. You are. These, these, these you have. My question is, what strategic intent do you have to evangelize and disciple these people? Police. Go and preach to them. I think, also for I think that you can become a chaplain to them. Morning devotions. You go and talk to them about morning, I mean, have morning devotions with them. It is good. The hospital. Of course, uh, one of the doctors is an Osofo, is uh, one of us. But you can, or you can assign one of your ministers to be praying with them. So chaplaincy is important. The big man of this area and the others who help him govern this organization. Have you visited him before? Have you prayed with him before? Does he know your presence? Remember that we are called to make disciples. Remember that we are not called to make babies. That's what First Peter said. Make disciples. From 1 Corinthians 3, 1 to 4, the marks of maturity are clear as those marks of infancy are also clear. In the old church, they are it is time for us to move and sing 494 a safe stronghold our God is still it is time for us to move on to grow from infancy to maturity requires word deeds and signs the church is the symbol and sign of God's power and performance in the world John 13 and verse 35 so disciple making has love that's why I chose love as basis of what so the disciple making has love as his basic reality if you look at Ephesians 4 1 to 16 that is what it is and so we encourage you to live that quality out that they may dream now every year. Treat people, therefore, as human beings. Human beings created in the image of God. My brother, don't treat people as a mixture of chemicals. Treat them as human beings. Don't treat them as a mixture of chemicals. As you do this, ensure that you develop good relational or cordial relationship with the sister churches that you share this area with if you are not already together begin the process of bringing them all together in the local council of churches have one voice on issues and live as brothers and sisters to promote the community good even if some may not be that friendly kindly show them the way of christ you have become a superintendent minister at a time when the nation needs prophets. Prophets who speak the mind of God. Let your preaching and teaching educate people to appreciate the teaching of the Bible. Therefore, speak the truth with all boldness but in humility and respect. Reprove 
rebuke, comfort, and do all those. Eshe unkom, eshe unkom, na yenshe unkom de, me binu mwa she unkom. Baba, utum kacho de nda yenshe unkom. Mwa wanyi wana, wanyi wana na nda wanyi unkom. Mama yenshe unzama otis de asolma yesre, asofo wawaha entiti ya wenyan. Lay preacher and it's near way in your okra, so my way and presiding straight, straight. The man ought to say, and it's near in your name, it's near wound your nominian. Yan to tunas, Mamma Yan Shet and Crawford was the one I young cadet. We didn't read in the young so yan 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 he says, be strong and courageous. Do not be terrified. Do not be discouraged. For the Lord your God will be with you wherever you go. And God said, have I not commanded you? Second Timothy 1, 6 to 7 says, For this reason, I remind you to keep alive the gift that God gave to you when I laid my hands on you. For the spirit that God gave us does not make us timid. Instead, his spirit fills us with power, with love, and self-control. Yes, Razo. Yes, Razo. Superintendent was was This is your circuit, and this is what you have to do. Read Joshua 1 7 to 9, you find it there. Read 2 Timothy 1 6 to 7, and you find it. So, what's also for Dangwa? These are no days for timid uh, being timid timidity and the, no, these are no days for that there are no days for lazy and uh, lay back superintendent ministers they are not the days if you are lazy if you are timid if you are lay back we will create a special uh, something for all such people Especially as you serve in this diocese. A diocese that prides itself as a model diocese. We need you, therefore, to be abreast with the times. And remember, what your Nigerian films were, what's, it, uh, what's your surname? Surname, what's your surname? What's your surname? What's your surname? Your surname. What's your surname? Then who do people say that you are? What's your surname? Who is your mother? Who is your father? Remember that Northern Accra Diocese was born out of Accra. And Accra Diocese, I say, have been paid searches ever since. Right from whenever. They have been paid searches. And we are following them closely. We will, we will overcome, we will surpass them. We will surpass them. That's why we are a model diocese. We will surpass, because you see, uh, or who will be our parent to be our main you change it number was number was said to the man who buy a casa we need it that's the mahaiti over here since this is i'm the shortest in the house who buy a pay or it's just or you're okay or who will be our or who will be our and a crowd houses is happy i'm sorry also for somebody left a crowd houses is happy that we are here and we will surpass them because they are passages, passages who give us birth. And we are a model diocese, a model modeling over and above our parents. So there is no need for procrastination, my brother. There is no need for you to hesitate. Rather, let us act. The superintendent must be strong and courageous, and he must confront issues headlong. Often have we seen superintendents or people leaders uh, being quiet on issues this should not happen jesus says you shall not lord it over your colleagues remember your circuit ministers my brother labor with you in connection 
just as all of us labor with one another in connection we are brothers and sisters respect them give them their due respect show love towards them and do as you have to do in the final analysis it is character that we are talking about indeed Paul in 1 Corinthians 1 to 4 wrote to wrote appreciatively of Apollos' ministry I'm ending here and says I planted the seed Apollos watered it but God gave the increase this is partnership in ministry where each must contribute his or her quota for the furtherance of the work this partnership models after what we call division of labor also you can't do it all as well remember circuit also cannot do it all also cannot do it all yesterday he showed me um, a mini mini cathedral that they want to build over here he showed it to me yesterday sir ochinebi conference stationing committee what are they also for inquire now so for for umbra on jelly one person for nasa okay this is the vision of labor there are the davids the davids who gather the materials for the solomons to come and work and build with those materials we should understand that like Shakespeare said, the world is a stage. And therefore, as a new circuit, put the structures in place for its smooth running. Ensure that processes and procedures are carried through to their logical conclusions. Teach them, teach the staff, teach the circuit what Methodism is all about. Teach them the constitution and the standing orders. Teach them our practice. Teach them our ethos. I said finally, but in conclusion, in, in, in conclusion, remember God's promise to Joshua. Submit to the will of God. As a leader and as a circuit, be people of faith trusting in the Lord all the time the choir sang a hymn that I have here trust in us the moments fly trust in us the days go by trust in him whatever before trust in Jesus that that trust takes away anxiety that trust takes away all challenges and problems and only renders thanks to God as we commence this new circuit be committed be dedicated be loyal be sincere be truthful be trustworthy be dependent and be devoted as we spread this work Philippians 4 and verse 8 Paul says finally my brothers and sisters whatever is true whatever is noble whatever is right whatever is just whatever is pure whatever is lovely whatever is admirable if anything is excellent or praiseworthy think about these things shall we please bow down our heads maybe you have been attending worship services but you don't have Jesus as your Lord and Savior today is a day of salvation that 
then as a demon, nay, and bomb paddle on my young cordu young one, nay, and summon the manipulate. You can't come with a wife friend, and they yen your circuit for four. I had a young yawo circuit out for four yard, but come with a young one better than Yamiasi. You can't come with a wife friend in here, do your superintendent. Yami Shang and his son. No, you don't want to. The young summer. Then he appeared. What? I was not what if you will rise. The woman, you'll be a man from coming and they be a redder. Obiara or Bompa will be so will rise. Oh, Isra, men from coming and they be a redder. As my effort here. Number Yenus Fufu, Yavon Summer. Sagiti on for the temple, friend. The house is the on for the temple, friend. Connection is on for the temple, friend. Now you know, soon you know, 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 you